Hey everyone, welcome back. So being locked out of your computer due to a forgotten password can be more than just an inconvenience as it can hold the productivity, block access to the important file and cause unnecessary stress. Now the traditional method of password recovery often involves the resetting the PC which can lead to the data loss or using the bootable media which can be complicated for the user who aren't that tech savvy. And in this video, I will be using the PassFab for WinKey comprehensive step-by-step -step tutorial on how to reset a forgotten password for Windows 10 and 11 without losing any of your data. And it will be very simple and you can use this method to reset the password or bypass the password of any other device having Windows 10 or Windows 11. Alright, so you will have to come to this website. The link will be in the description and it says create Windows password reset USB CD DVD drive and regain access to your PC instantly. Now if you want to read about them that how exactly it work. So it says reset password with a bootable USB drive simply to use 100% recovery rate secure no data loss. You can bypass reset remove all kind of administrator or user password. Okay, so once you come here, you will have to click on free download. And it's a small file, so it will be quickly downloaded. So click on the downloaded file. Click on yes. Click on install. And the installation process will be started and it won't take much time. So kindly wait and click on start. And the software will start loading up. Now, meanwhile, you can also connect the USB that you want to make the password recovery uh, USB. And it can be at least of 2 gigabyte or 4 gigabyte because it won't take much space. So now once you come up here, it says password for win key. You will have to click on the start and it will be collecting some information. Now it says make a boot disk and it will ask you to select the USB that you want to make the password recovery USB. So if you have not connected yet, then connect the USB. And once you have connected, it will automatically detect here. I'm using here the Kingston uh, pen drive, the USB drive that is around 60 gigabyte. So once you have selected the right USB, now you will have to click on the start burning. Click on next and make sure that guys you don't have any kind of data inside that USB because everything will be wiped out. So you can take the data backup in case if you have any important data inside it and then you can start this process. So click on next and the process of creating the password recovery disk will be started and it won't take much time but still you will have to wait I guess for a minute. So let's wait until the process is being completed. And bingo, so now you can see it was done very quickly and it says burn successfully. Please unplug the boot disk, insert into the locked computer and continue as follows. So it will give you instruction here that now you need to connect this bootable USB to the computer, to the locked computer where you want to unlock the password. And then you need to change the boot priority order to boot with the bootable USB. So click on next. And now further it gives you some explanation of the boot option shortcut. So if you're not sure that how exactly to change the boot priority order. So for laptop, it shows you different keys here. Like in the Acer, you can try F12 or FN plus F12. And for the IBM, you can try this one for the Asus, Dell. So you can check your manufacturer here for desktop. It's been displayed here. Then finally, you will have to click on next. Next. And now you can close the box here. And this time, if I bring up the file explorer and open my drive here, so you can see all the files are being created inside my this USB. OK, so we have the USB ready now. Now we can connect to the lock computer and simply unlock the password. So now let's see how exactly it work. OK, so now I am on a Windows 11 machine and you can see that I have been stuck on the login page. I don't remember the password here and the user account name is DougGo. All right, so now what you have to do, plug in the USB to this computer and restart the computer. And again, you will have to use the BIOS key to change the boot priority order. So select the USB, hit the enter key and you will be getting this kind of page here. So you can choose UFI for win key force high, hit the enter key. And this will now start loading the file. And again, it will not take much time. So kindly wait until it's all been done. OK, and very quickly, you will be getting this kind of page that says PassFab for WinKey and it will display your main operating system drive. So you need to select it and then you have to click on next. All right, so now it will display all kind of your user account created on this device. Like on my end, you can see I have the administrator account, default account, Duggo and the guest account. 
on your end it can be other user account that you have created now you will have to select the account for which you have been forgot the password you have been logged like on my end it's duggo account i will select it now once you select it at the bottom you find different option like you can either remove the account password or you can reset it you can manage the file management you can delete the windows account or even you can create a new user account and there is one more option that is for the bypassing the password so what i will choose here that it will be remove account password because i find this best and it will be removing any kind of password and i can log into my device without any password and then further on i can change the password okay so select this option and click on next now it's removing the account password and it will be done very quickly and it says duggo account password has been removed please reboot the computer now this time if i click on reboot the computer will now be starting normally so let's see until the login screen comes up all right so we are on the login page and great now you can see it's not asking us any kind of password i have to simply click on sign in and here it goes so now you can see we are inside the computer and we successfully unlock the password of this computer so it's very simple guys very easy to use and not only for this computer now you can use the same usb to reset or remove any kind of other password now let me quickly show you for another computer all right so right now i am on another windows 11 machine and again it's asking me the password and i don't remember it okay so what i can do again i can connect my usb the bootable usb that i have created for the password recovery and then i need to restart the computer and i will restart in the bio so that i can change the boot priority order so that it next time it can boot with my bootable usb so select the usb again hit the enter key hit the enter key again and it will start loading the file quickly so again wait for a few seconds here okay wonderful so now again you can see the password for winky dashboard came up again you have to select the drive click on next this time it will display another kind of user account created on this device so i will have to select the one with which i have the problem where i have forgotten the password so on this computer i forgot the password for this user account so i will select it then it says reset account password so either you can go with this option but i will again keep this option selected to remove account password so that i can show you how exactly it work then click on next and very quickly it will be removing the account password and it's all been done now simply go ahead and reboot and you are all done so this time when the computer will be starting up you will find that it will not be asking you for any kind of password and you can see it automatically log in to my desktop without asking for any kind of password bingo and that's great so now you can see that how easy it was to quickly access your desktop even you forget the password all right guys so this is how exactly it work and hopefully you found one of the convenient way to reset or remove the password of any windows 10 or windows 11 without losing your data or without losing anything okay so now in order to check their pricing you can come to their website and here it says 30 day money back guarantee so in case if you uh, purchase the product and you're not satisfied then even you can take the money back they are providing you the free customer support the free update and 100 percent secure guarantee now you can check their pricing you can go with a professional one and you can enjoy the 20 percent off for this coupon code and even here i will leave the code for the 30 percent off the code will be in the description you can check that out so that's all guys for today and hopefully you enjoyed the video if yes do not forget to like and subscribe and i see you in the next video Bye bye